uh, how's it kind of been just day one with a uh, new running back coach? Uh, it's, a, it's been a great day, really. Um, you know, just getting back out there with the guys, and you know, we got a great leader, Coach Scott. So um, just being out here, getting our feet moving again, it feels good to have a new change up. Earlier today, Locks talked about how there are so many new new faces on the coaching side, especially on the offensive side of the ball, but the system's the same, the culture's the same. How have you seen that play out so far? Oh, yeah, it's definitely been something, you know, everybody's getting used to seeing new faces and things like that, but uh, football is football, and, you know, we do a great job coming out here and working together, and it's kind of cool to have some new faces to work with. Roman, how great is it to have you know, all these offensive lines in your offense, or like with Coach Gaddis and someone coming in, Locks coming back, um, you know, Latrell coming in to coach the running backs, and then, Kalia for a fourth year. Just, do you feel like this offense is really loaded and in a good position right now? Oh yeah, I feel like um, in this business of football, you always got to get better. Um, I feel like we're in a, in a great spot. We're elevating and we're, we're continuing to push forward. Um, obviously, we're going to need to work and take some work. and uh, It's definitely going to take some work to get to where we want to be, but we feel like we're in a, in a great position to take that next step as a program. A lot of new faces on the O-line. What was it kind of like running behind them for the first time? Uh, it felt good, you know. Um, these guys do a great job. They meet a lot. They, you know, meet around the clock to just, you know, learn their things and things like that. So they make my job easy. They've always made my job easy, and I feel like um, we hit the ground running today, and it feels good. What's that comfortability like? You know, knowing that you have a lot of the same guys in the running back room as last year. That you, Colby, Ramon, etc. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it feels good. Uh, we got the same guys that we're competing with. Um, those are my brothers, really. Um, you know. Uh, it feels good coming in here knowing that even on a bad day, you got somebody that can, you know, help you out. And that's what it's all about because to win in the Big Ten at the running back position, it's not going to take one guy. It's not going to take two guys. It's going to take every single one of us. So uh, we have a close-knit uh, friendship, you know, a brotherhood or whatever. So uh, going out there every day and playing with one another is definitely a special feeling for all of us. Who's the freshman that stands out most to you on offense? Uh, haven't seen much yet, uh, but I feel like the whole receiver room is a whole like. We got some guys that come out here and they, they know their stuff early, faster than I was able to pick up the offense, I would say. So um, that's definitely impressive. And they, you know, just come out here and work. That's what I like to see. When it comes to, to you know, trying to, to, to pick up things, um, how, how has it been working with Coach Scott, trying to get to know him on and off the field, that part, um, being around a new coach? Oh, yeah, you know, being a new coach is something, you know, we both got to get used to each other and things like that. But from what I've seen so far and what I've been through with him, I feel like uh, he's very knowledgeable. So somebody I can definitely, you know, learn a lot from. So it's definitely good to play under somebody like that. And I feel like um, everybody wants to play this game to win. So I know we have the same, you know, thought process to everything. And, you know, he has his things that, you know, we got to get used to. But uh, it's definitely something that I took and I, I'm happy to do. And we're, I'm willing to do the challenge. What's the first day of spring practice look like for you now as compared to last year? year um, you know, it's definitely become different, you know, being a veteran, you know, definitely different than what it was my first year going through the spring, the spring ball process. So um, just taking the little things that I learned throughout the way, you know, rehabbing more often, just keeping my legs under me so that I can play those snaps late in November when, you know, my body starts to wear down and things like that. And just elevating my game to where I can just, you know, keep bettering myself to help this team. Rumi, you talk about elevating your game. Sorry if I missed anything. Batter, had a battery issue there. Um, so sorry if I repeat something. So but last year you had a lot of games out there where it seemed like you were just shot out of a cannon, making these huge runs left and right. What have you done in the off season to work towards improving on that yourself? Personally? Oh yeah, all those things happen right here, really. Uh, right here and in, in camp and even winter workouts. Those are where those runs are made. So. I feel like me being the player that I want to be and the, and the man I am, I just come out here every day and just want to become better. So I push myself, and that's what you guys will see if you come out here and you see the spring practices and things like that. I'll do a lot of pushing myself and trying to take that next step. So when it comes to the season, those things happen more easy for me. How much do you and Antoine push each other? Uh, we all push each other. Uh, I would say me and him just being in the position that we are in, we push each other a lot. Um, you know, just want to see each other be successful, and we feel like we have a unique thing going on, especially with, you know, how uh, our system is run here. Um, you know, just having that relationship to where we can, you know, help each other on and off the field is definitely something that you can't take for granted. Obviously, it's the same system, but with the new coaches, what is the difference that you've noticed so far? Uh, you know, just new terminology, you know, it's different fundamentals sometimes, you know, uh, just things that I feel like even if it was it's still old coaching staff, we would do, you know, updating things and we always want to find ways to advance our offense and take that next step. So um, 
I'm no, not panicking. Nobody's panicking. We're just here to get better, and I feel like we are going to get better every practice that we have. What do you think the next step of this offense is? Um, um, I feel like just, you know, fine-tuning the, the details. Um, I feel like we're in the position to make those plays, and uh, we talk about it all the time. It was a few plays last year that kind of made or break, uh, made or broke our uh, offensive attack. So um, I feel like just being more seasoned and just, uh, you know, taking those reps and, and progressing every day so that we can make those plays and keep the offense on the field and score a lot of points. That's what we want to do.